one. Chungus, good run. Chungus, good run. Chungus, 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 good run. <clears throat> Go ahead, Miney. Say, say your piece. <laughs> Thank you for that wonderful musical rendition. Welcome back, everyone, to Potterfun Ten. Uh, joining, joining us, us once, once again, again is the wonderful Porto Man. I don't know why they called you Porto Man. You, you've grown up. You're a Porto Man now. Yes, I, I have grown balls since we last met, chat. And uh, speaking of balls, uh, th that was a weird segue. Uh, Swordman has once again donated another $30 uh, saying, Chungus could run. Chungus could run. Changus, good run, and this time has attributed it to the Wise H words. six potions rush run. One final time, I will remind you because I feel like people are probably sick of hearing it at this point. Um, we have got the potions rush incentive. It is currently uh, ninety dollars away from being hit. If we raise that ninety dollars in this run, Nikki will do that run next. If we don't, we have something else that will throw you, which we're cooking up. Uh, but I think we have uh, waylaid long enough. I cannot hold you from your precious chungus anymore, Portal. That's that's true. Take it away. Hello, everyone. Every once in a while, a speedrunning community will do something remarkable. And that entails, uh, in our situation, um, something that uh, is, to me, very special. Because... Uh, a speedrun does not necessarily have to be competitive or serious all the time. However, uh, roughly two years back, this was created uh, when Ryan had an idea. And Ryan's idea was a very funny idea. I found this little easter egg uh, that the developers left in the game. Where as you can see, every time Harry jumps, he casts all spells in an area around him. Now this is um, interesting because it lets us uh, finish the game very quickly and in, uh, in under 10 minutes actually. In fact, in under 8 minutes if you play well. Um, the rules are simple. Simply don't cast any spells and uh, uh, as you can see, you know, every time he jumps he causes earthquakes. Uh, now, it's incredibly special to me that a run that started off as a meme was taken to a position where it is now easily the most competitive uh, category extension on the leaderboards, and it's not close. Um, first of all, it has like 50 runs on the leaderboard, which is insane. Um, that's absolutely bonkers. Um, also, my textures are completely messed up, what the hell. Anyway, um, when you take a category like this and you turn it into a competitive um, leaderboard, uh, all of a sudden something interesting starts happening. People start finding strategies uh, that otherwise will not have been discovered. Um, and it happened. We found the Aragog strategy as well as some other optimizations. We popularized some skips for any percent that people were scared to go for before us simply because they were too scary. However, what this little run did for us is it let us practice our late game in a way that is fun and unique. It gave us the challenge of finishing the game without casting any spells. Uh, it gave us a sense of community and we have hosted two Chungus tournaments uh, during my time. Um, was it two or three? It might have been three actually. Uh, regardless of uh, how it is, um, the interest has always been overwhelming. Uh, uh, there's a lot of unnecessary hate this has gotten um, over the last year because it's a meme run. However, I want to remind people that at the end of the day, we're here to have fun. And what, what people did with this speedrun is genuinely remarkable. Taking it to the level that it is right now 
a level that rivals the main leaderboards on both submissions, optimization, competitiveness and skill requirement is honestly impressive, while at the same time discovering new strategies and tech for any percent, which as many of you that run the video game know, um, that's, a, that's a category that people have spent a long time optimizing, and more often than not, it's these little silly categories like low cast, jumpless, chungus, high jump, that will end up discovering things that would otherwise never be discovered. For example, here, we needed a solution uh, to beat Aragog faster, um, because, you know, otherwise it's really slow. Uh, and we found it. Okay, mistimed that, that's fine, or miscounted that. And we're here now. This is Chungus. Um, and it's an old category now, not a lot of people play it anymore. However, I want to remind people that there is a tutorial. Uh, the board is still there. It is a really short run, really fun run, really easy to get into, and it actually teaches you a lot about this game. You can learn menuing, you can learn movement, you can learn two cycle, you can learn potionless snake, you can learn so much tech, you can become good at the Aragog strategy for categories like glitchless, right? Um, and yeah, um, the fact that it got to where it is uh, today uh, to me is, um, is is remarkable. And I'd like to thank everyone who contributed uh, to that. Now, there is a documentary that we made um, over a year ago now about this run. Um, there's another one in the works for another one. The strat that I'm about to do was popularized by this as well. There we go. Very difficult to boost that one. There, we got it. And yeah, I recommend checking it out. This is Chamber. There's a really difficult strategy here that we're not gonna go for. I'm gonna take this safe. Well, um, this is possible, but I prefer not to. There we go. Here we are entering chamber two. Jump. We. And destroy both of the ropes there. It's pretty funny. I think it's really funny that Chungus works in an AoE manner, right? Like, it's an area of effect thing. You recognize a lot of the straps from any percent because they're similar. Um, Ma'am. If we're careful here, we might be able to pull uh, Salbate. The ending goes well. There's one last hard part left. See if we can get it. Good. That was perfect. That's harder than it looks, by the way. One, two, three, four, five, six. You know what? I'll wait. Should be fine. Snake will be the uh, same as in Glitchless, which I just performed. The only difference is I'm allowed to pause cast, which cancels my animation, so it's a little bit faster. We're only gonna do it once for this phase because damage boosting or taking damage in the poison intentionally and then doing it like this is faster than pause casting. Uh, this is awkward. Oh! Psycho skip! 
rip sub 8. Okay. Well, it's like it's a uh, four cycle. That was an accident. Oh. <laughs> okay. Jesus. Stop. Okay, a little anticlimactic after that first cycle, but what can you do? Sometimes mistakes are made. No. And time will approach right now. This is Chungus. We'll leave it at that. Time. Thanks for watching, everybody. 8.29. Wow, I don't think I've ever heard quite the motivational speech like that before. That was uh, quite the monologue you gave us, thank you. So, if that doesn't motivate you to go run Chunkus, then uh, you need to, like, I, there's something wrong with you. <laughs> if that doesn't motivate you to go run this category. Uh, as as Paul said, he has been probably the biggest like advocate for such the category, and it is definitely one that's worth checking out. There have been two tournaments, like Paul said, on his channel and uh, Phil Phil My Goods, aka Ryan's channel. Definitely should go and check those out. The vods are available. But yeah, that was Chandos. And now you can witness it in its full glory. But it is regrettable for me to say this is the end of Changus. And it also seems as though we are not going to be seeing the special run uh, from Nikki. But we have been cooking something else that might be of interest. But before we get there, I want to read off this $10 donation from Forgetti Spaghetti saying, Remember, everyone, if you don't break your spaghetti, you can't be Forgetti. Chungus, good run. Putting that towards the the Nikki uh, incentive and also towards Hufflepuff in the uh, uh, in the legacy run. So, uh, without further ado, we're going to head back to transition, and we'll be back with something a little different. Don't go away. We're right back after this message. After these messages. 